in Minnesota's 153 year history, we've had 39 governors. Each of those governors at the end of his term has to look back and decide if he's built the state that he wanted to build, if he's seen a vision through that he wanted to see through. The portraits inside this state capitol give us a glimpse into their successes and their failures. Arne Carlson was a conservative who was also an avid Gopher fan. At the end of his administration, he could say he made a commitment to education, something his portrait represents. At the end of his administration, Jesse Ventura wanted to be known as a thinker, as someone who rabble roused and created some independent thought in Minnesota. Whether he did that or not, his portrait certainly tries to represent that. What does Governor Palenti's portrait tell us about his legacy? How do you put new fees, new property taxes into a portrait? How do you put a disinvestment into schools, into a picture? How do you put the state's biggest structural deficit into a picture? You don't. You make the most generic picture possible and hope that years later, no one remembers how your policies failed this state.